Oh, All right. It's gonna be real weird. Welcome to the first episode of teaching this noob how to play golf. Me and Brayden are gonna try our best to make him a pro. Brayden said he wants to be referred to referred to as Tor Pro Brayden. So Tor Pro Brayden's probably gonna lead the way here. He knows more about the golf swing than I do, but yeah. Never gonna... swung a golf club in my life except for putt putt, and I have a baseball background. So. Yep. All right. So we'll we're see. gonna warm up here and get right at it. So the first thing we're gonna fix is gonna be his grip. So, just show me, show me how you grip it right now. Show the camera how you grip. Uh, with Evan, get the grip. So we can see he's got baseball grip. You play baseball on your past? Yes. Okay, I can 100%. tell. So what we're gonna do is we're gonna get you to interlock, which is gonna look something like this, with the fingers interlocked. Okay. So we're gonna interlock your left pointer finger and your right pinky finger so, so right just there, one finger just one finger all right space it out just a touch and then what we want to do is get this hand turned over just a touch more right there so lock that one in and then we get this one more here right there that's perfect so and then what we're going to do is we're taking 50 percent swings at most okay so nothing harder than 50 so take a couple practice swings And then the only other thing I want to change before we get started hitting balls is this foot doesn't come off the ground ever. Okay. So just leave that one on the ground. Yeah, like that. But get that full rotation through the ball. Don't quit. Yeah, there it is. 50%. All right, let's hit a ball. Okay. 50% swing. New grip. Yep. And you can see how much that's helped already. <laughs> Back away from the ball. I'm too close. You're like right on top of it. Okay. It's good for putting, but we're not putting. Yeah, so what you want to feel is your hands just hang down naturally. You're not out here, you're not up here. You just want to relax them. Right in there is perfect. That is improvement. Well, from the last one. From the last one. Grip changes are always the hardest, though, I will say. It's going to take you a few, few swings to get used to it. So scoot away from it just a touch. Perfect. It's all right, brother. We're going to get through this together, all right? You just slap the mic. It's all right. <laughs> now there, that's playable. Where'd it go? Just barely right. Okay. How did that one feel? Tell the people. That actually felt good. I'm not 100% sure where it went though. That was just a little but baby it sounded, fade. But it sounded like a good shot. Yeah, it sounded like Tiger Woods there, brother. Uh, I wouldn't go broken. that far. I wouldn't go that far. All right, same thing, 40%, loose tempo. And then I want to strengthen your grip just a touch more. So I let go. I want it right there. So now I'll move that hand and then interlock. Yes, right there. That's going to look really weird. Thumb under. Now just swing. Don't even think about where the club face is at. Just okay. swing. Smooth tempo. Uh, that's working in the right direction. All right, so we're going to move up. We're going to go eight iron. 
This is my favorite club, by the way. So if you hit your this favorite one, club, if you hit this one bad, you're just I suck. I think you're just a lost cause at that point. I suck. Yeah. yeah you should probably just go probably home. just just go home. So same thing, same grip, same tempo. Swing's looking good. Is that, is that right? Yeah. So look, if you want to check it, fingertips first, and then you want to be able to see two to three knuckles. Right. Yeah. Right there. Feels like the club face is facing wrong. Huh? Looks like it's like too closed off. It is, it's to the left. And because you're doing that because you're opening it at impact. So we're just counteracting. Hold on, tell me. That one sucks. Alright, Jack. You're John Alive. Okay, he has a mic. I have a mic. You are probably 20 swings in here. A little more. How are you feeling right now? I've hit a couple good ones, or what I felt were good ones compared to my other ones, but uh, some of them are absolutely just stunk. Yeah. It's, has, a, it's a learning curve yeah. from anything I've, else I've ever done. He has promise. It's just you got to get him hit the ball and then the ground, not the ground and the ball. Um, I think if he just consistently hits the ball first, you'll be hitting pretty decent shots. Not amazing shots, because you're obviously not a pro. Oh, yeah. But. Not yet. Yeah. We'll get there. We'll get there. We'll get there. Look what I just did. I made a beast. Just saw a little <laughs> grip change. Hardware. <laughs> Don't make fun of my clubs. Right, so we got the. So today we've got. Let me do, let me do it my funny boy. Let's do mine. All right. So Jack came to us with. Oh, you gotta get the frame though. Jack came to us with a couple clubs today. We're, right here we got the the Nike Ignite. It's a nine, nine and a half degree. Um, the Graffaloi Blue, real fancy driver shaft here. And, I mean, heck, like. You can probably see it on camera, but this thing is wobbly. But I'm sure Jack can swing it. Just do it. So get your feet maybe a little more than shoulder width, right at shoulder width. And you're going to put that ball like in line with your left heel. So okay. like if I was swinging, like this be in line, I could put that there and then come to my left heel. Okay. So. There's that, and right here. really same grip. Um, we'll still have you do a soft, kind of soft swing just to feel it out. But the end should just look something like this. You really don't even need. <laughs> oh, he wants this. He wants the swing video. You really don't even need a T. Like some, it's kind of overrated. You just. Oh, yeah. It's a worm burner. Yeah. No. I'd be able to do it, man. Uh -huh. All right, let's get you swinging. Okay. Like I said, left heel, keep your hands like they were. Swing nice and smooth. A little wider, back, yeah, yeah, yeah. Left heel looks good. Yeah, there you go, perfect. He's about to nuke this, I already know. Gosh, this feels so I cool. might want to get over here though, just in case. Hey, if you hit the ball instead of the ground, that's good. Man, y'all supposed to be teaching me. That was like 40 yards left. Yeah, that I know. I, yeah. All right. I just had to hit a little shot real quick. Oh, Christ. Weight transfer. I totally missed. Remember what Brayden told you about? Yes. Walking forward. Yep. Get that weight in that left foot. There you go. Here, hold up. I'm gonna do something real quick. So, 
Put your put your hands out. Just like let me see this. <laughs> Drop your hands, like let them relax. Okay, so before you grip the club, grip it how like we told you to grip it. So like that. Mm -hmm. Now let go a little bit. I'm just gonna turn it. Keep it same grip. We're gonna see how that does. Okay. Expect Whoa. You hit the ball though. I did hit the ball that time. So go back to original where you had it turned and the club face was turned a little bit. I would hit the ball. I just wanna see what would happen, which is exactly what happened. There's like a scuff mark on this ball. Huh. Hit it. Hit it. Hit that joker. He just Matthew Wolf the heck out of that, but he just struck it. Nice shot. Woo. Yikers. There you go. Where'd it go? To the left. Oh. Hey, left is good. Especially here. That tee's right under you. He said, oh, oh, there it is. I almost said something naughty. Yeah. <laughs> just remember, we're on film. Don't I know. Really All done. right. Same thing. See if you can do it again. Just like really feel yourself get into that left foot and like put your right hip in. Yeah. Oh, golly. What is strike? Three, he's nah, out I'm here. out, I'm done. Let me see that. One thing that, this is my club, this is my teaching club. One thing that my, uh, the guy who taught me how to swing, Tiger Woods, used to always say yes. to me, was of course. if you're swinging, and if you get to your third swing and you're walking all over the place and you're off balance, that's a bad swing. Bad swing. That's a bad swing. So what we gotta do, is we gotta keep you balanced. So you can swing as hard as you want, as long as you can finish right there. See what I'm saying? Yep. I like that a lot better than you missing the ball. That's true. I made contact with the ball and not just the air. So, Jack's been doing pretty well. He's making contact here at the end, which at the, at the start, wasn't really making very yeah, good Yeah, I think contact. we made good improvement today. We got him squaring up the club face a little bit, moving the ball a little bit to the left. Yeah, so good. now we're gonna go over here to this part three course, just have some fun, see where he's at, see where his putting's at, where his short game's Oof. at. Um, but yeah, might do a little, just a little couple tips for putting. It's not that hard. Yeah. Um, but yeah, we'll, transition over there now. Goodbye kitties. <laughs> <laughs>